WTBA Sports with Sports Director Jim Holder. Military Appreciation Night at ICC, and it was also the North Division opener for the Indians. Not an easy opener at that. Number one ranked and defending national champion East Mississippi. Fulton native VJ Miller is the Lions quarterback. North Pontotoc product Clark Mills getting the start under center for ICC. More on him in a bit. As for VJ Miller, he got EMCC off to a nice start. Opening drive for the Lions. Miller finds Adrian Miller. Miller to Miller, making it Miller time. 41 yard touchdown, and EMCC's up early 7 0. Next drive for the Lions. Miller goes deep to another target. Ontario Drummond, 69-yard touchdown, EMCC up 14-0. Indians would cut it to 14-3, but the Lions would come right back down the field, and this time through the ground game. Deion McIntosh, a 7-yard touchdown run, making it 21-3, EMCC. But the Indians hanging in there. Second quarter, Mills had a lot of good throws in this one, finding Jamel Thomas, who takes it down to the 1-yard line. ICC had to settle for a Caleb Comber field goal. He had a couple of them in the first half to cut it at 21 to 6. And then he gets much closer. Deshaun Dinkins coming much closer to us because he's got nothing but open field in front of him. 88 yard touchdown run cuts it to 21 to 13, but all EMCC after that. Lions win 56 26 and they remain undefeated. It was also Military Appreciation Night at Northeast. It was also the North Division opener for the Tigers. Northeast hosting the MACJC's other Tigers from Cahoma. Northeast still looking for its first win of the season. To Tiger Stadium we go and Northeast wastes little time. Second play from scrimmage. Zach Oden hitting Carson Banks on a slant and Banks takes it 77 yards to the house. You can bank on him. Northeast Tigers up 7 to nothing quickly. Ensuing Cahoma possession on third down. Sam Williams, what a year he's having so far, wraps up Myra North, North Fleet for the sack. So Cahoma punts it back to Northeast. They would get it in the red zone, settle for this 27-yard Michael Bogus field goal. 10 nothing Northeast. Cahoma would take the lead in this one, but Northeast wins the Battle of Tigers 20-18. to Also Northwest, a winner over Mississippi Delta, 59-16. High school football, Myrtle versus Hickory Flat in New Albany. Both teams share this field. Myrtle was the visiting team tonight. There was a lengthy lightning delay in this game, but on the first play of the second quarter, after the delay, I.A. Nugent breaks off a 50-yard touchdown run. And the Hawks are up 21 to nothing. The Rebels would score a touchdown on the ensuing kickoff to get on the board. Myrtle then comes right back as Nugent again. Another big run. Near own Andy Lee into Hickory Flat territory, much to the delight of Myrtle head coach Justin Hollis. A couple of plays later, guess who? It's once again IA Nugent caps off the drive with a 16 yard touchdown run, and Myrtle wins 41 to 14. The Hawks are now 4-1 in their first season. Mississippi State women's basketball coach Vic Schaefer in Tupelo today. Schaefer, the guest speaker and instructor at the 2018 Northeast Mississippi Basketball Coaches Association Coaching Clinic. This is at the Tupelo Police Athletic League. Schaefer is the reigning Naismith Coach of the Year after taking MSU to two consecutive national championship games. He was awarded recently with a big contract extension, and he discussed that with WTVA's Andy Lee. We love Mississippi State. We've had such, it's been so much fun the six years we've been there. And I just appreciate Dr. Keenum and uh, Coach Cohen and, and their uh, trust and confidence. So we're looking forward to uh, this season. Uh, we should be good again. We'll be different, but uh, we should be very talented. Already looking forward to that. High school softball. Nettleton, a winner over New Hope, 13 to 9. Smithville, they got a big tournament on Saturday. Lady Knowles beat Thrasher, 18 to 8. And Houston, a winner over Louisville, 19 to 4. Paige Kilgore and Quanta Brandley hitting homers in that one. Friday night fever tomorrow night. Amory at Nettleton, our game of the week. We'll have plenty of other games as well. At sports, one news after this.